Well, I don't know if you saw my previous video on my Neo Pixels. Now these come as single. So I've actually soldered, there's 50 of these things on there, so it wasn't very easy to actually solder them. The lighting, the, the, the brightness of these things is absolutely brilliant. Well, these are actually the Neo Pixels. They're basically addressable LEDs, the WS2812, I think they are, something like that. Anyway, I've got 600 of these. Now, I was wondering what to do with it, do with them. Uh, to actually connect them, I don't know if you can see, you connect a common uh, 5 volt common ground and you've got digital in, digital out. So, I think I'm going to make an LED matrix, a 600 LED matrix, but Lining these up and soldering them with them together, it's just it's not gonna it's not gonna take five minutes. Oh yeah, you have to have them the right way as well. So <laughs> I'm gonna oh, I'm stupid but I'm gonna do it. Four hundred LEDs I have just soldered. It's just taken me twelve hours to do that. I was going to do six hundred, but I've really lost the will to live. Bit of hot glue. So. You're not going to see the back anyway because it's going to be mounted on a piece of um, hardboard or plywood or something. 400 LEDs. <laughs> I've done some stupid things but oh god. Right, this is from the other side. I don't know if you can see they're not perfectly in line. They're not far off. I'm not doing it again. Right, I've got a simple script running through it. Um, so that works okay. Now I've had a couple of um, a couple of the LEDs actually gone faulty. Or actually faulty on fitting. Um, one of them was um, giving a very uh, a very blue on white. So I've replaced those. They're pretty easy to replace. So that's just a simple test. The only uh, the only trouble I'm going to have is the current drain. Um, you're talking quarter of an amp just with uh, just with that displaying. So we'll see. I've temporarily mounted it on a, a on a piece of hardboard um, chip plywood. Sorry, just to keep it uh, safe. Now the reason why I've actually done it in two halves, um, number one it was easier and number two is because of the power. Um, a strip of 40 wire by 5 high actually draws about 3.5 amps when it's on white. So I need two BECs basically. So now, I'll just turn that light off. <coughs> now this is only on, um, it's at 100 out of 255, which is probably 50% brightness. So if I plug it in, and at the moment that's all it, you can't really see it. So it's just cycling through colours at the minute. Um, I've got to, <laughs> I have got a load more to do to it with the uh, the programming side of it. 
yeah, I'm quite uh, quite happy. I don't know why that only says half amp on there, but if you if I knock that up to full, it just I mean the the, uh, the BEC actually gets yeah, it's getting quite warm already. So there you go. 400 LEDs and I'm never doing it again. <laughs>